Let's see, it's been almost a year, and we started the relationship and partnership back in March of 2011 with uh, evaluating one of the programs we have, and then we quickly moved into pilot and to full implementation by the end of the year. Okay, can you tell me anything about that first program you evaluated? What was the program and how you evaluated? So the program was a leadership development program focused on coaching, and we had been rolling the program out for about 18 months, uh, and so we had a lot of uh, folks that went through the class, but um, we didn't know their perception or the extent to which they were applying it. So uh, there was some question in the leadership around, around just that, so we went ahead and we measured past participation as well as um, current participants in the class. Okay, Leo, what was your initial measurement challenge? Well, our initial measurement challenge was twofold. First and foremost, we did not consistently measure any of our 400 learning programs. And uh, in, in, in case, or I guess in, in a few cases, we used paper-based evaluations for any new or if we were going to maintain a program, we might choose to collect some feedback and then use Excel and do some basic analysis around the data. So that was our, our, our biggest challenge is that we were kind of operating by blindly as far as our programs and just going on gut from a decision-making perspective. Um, and then secondly, our the head of our learning organization, John Lawson, uh, created a new team within his group focused on learning effectiveness and he charged the group and um, asked me to lead the team in figuring out you know um, our processes how we are um, how effective we are from an operational perspective and there are several key areas of measurement that he wanted to bring focus and improve our data and analytics because we had close to none at that point so um, with that charter uh, move forward and developed a pretty quick partnership with Knowledge Advisors. What was an early success that you had that helped move your measurement efforts along? So an early success that we had was uh, with our one of our onboarding programs for our sales organization. It was a new program and we had br brought in a, a new group of sellers, a large group with, over the summer of last year. And so we measured using our, as part of our pilot with Knowledge Advisors, we measured that program. And then when we, uh, when we got to the end of that program, we had a series of both post-event and follow-up data, and we had a window of time before we were gonna bring in another group of sellers. So we were perfectly positioned to take the feedback and then uh, apply, it, apply changes to that program. It was visible, costly, strategic. It, it met all criteria to really um, spend some time analyzing and making some changes to the program. And the business was so receptive to the feedback um, and the, especially with the backing of the credibility around knowledge advisors. Uh, we, brought in, we brought in pretty, uh, I would say, early career sellers into this particular program. So we also had um, some interns who were in college uh, provide some feedback on the program and help us with the analysis. So that combination and feedback was really powerful to hear from our sellers themselves through the Knowledge Advisors evaluation process and then to hear from some uh, younger talent around how we could jazz up the program and make it more impactful. So it was a great win for us. So what was your measurement moment when someone outside of your group was able to use the information you were collecting? So our measurement moment was probably around uh, one, of our, one of our customer groups that we have had a more challenging relationship in the past, earning their trust and just being a true partner with them to help uh, be drive for great performance within their organization. And so there was a program that was uh, a staple for that organization and uh, it had been running the same way for several years. Um, the leadership within that organization was very involved in presenting out on their different functions and helping uh, as part of that program. And so we did some evaluation of that program and found out that you know, it was really not quite hitting the mark. And the way that the course was built was um, pretty flat and not driving towards application. So we. 
uh, we were able to provide that feedback and have um, an elevated conversation with the, that leadership. And it was a really powerful moment for us because it took our relationship to the next level. So Leah, what advice would you give people starting their measurement journey today? Well, I'm pretty early in that process. So uh, what I would say, and this is probably a quote from our new SVP of HR with Granger, Joseph High, he sets an expectation for our leaders to know your numbers and know your people, and probably not in that order. And so the, uh, the great thing about a measurement journey and uh, a partnership potentially with knowledge advisors is that it's going to help you know your numbers and then secondly you really have to help your people understand and use the numbers so I've put a lot of focus around uh, helping to build our capability within our learning group and to use the information to understand it and to make better decisions around how we're building learning and in influencing our organization you know I I would say that uh, in meeting other customers, I feel very validated in the short amount of time that I've been on this journey that we're, we're doing the right things and, and that it's okay to move fast. Um, I'm, you know, we've had several other companies leading the journey over the last 10 years in this space, um, 10 to 30 years really as far as research goes. And so um, I feel very comfortable to rely on the the knowledge capital in the industry and move quickly and make decisions and and reap the rewards so uh, don't be afraid to jump in knowledge advisors can provide the technology consulting and performance solutions to help get you started today simply visit our website at www.knowledgeadvisors.com 